favors. A man who was fair and strong. A man who gave his life for his kingdom. Honor him today. Honor... Not treated as equals. We are better than this. Than all of them. Do not drag me down to the sewers you wallow in. Baldis must have got to them. Those men must have heard the horn's call. The people of East Anglia have more courage than I imagined. The brothers' fleet, gathered and ready. Spread like wildfire. Men are pouring in from across East Anglia, and our ships stand ready. The Edward's Reeve is with us. His men will be here soon. More than his, the Kingsbury Horn has inspired men all across this kingdom. We will have the army we need. It seems Oswald got what he wanted in the end. Saxon and Dane united in common cause. A pity he is not here to see it. Forces will be ready soon. Are you ready to start the assault? I am. Our target is Burg Castle, said to be impenetrable. Good. Let them have their false confidence. By cover of night, Baldus will lead the field at the front gates. With Ruid's men distracted, our forces move on the sea gate from the backwaters at their backs. And once we're in, we'll leave no gate closed in that castle. Ruard's men cannot be allowed to dig in further. Your longship, is she ready? She awaits her own special glory. They need your words, Eivor. Oswald was a man who didn't hesitate when you sought him for favors. A man who was fair and strong. A man who gave his life for his kingdom. Honor him today. Honor his memory and fight with the same extra courage he showed! For Oswald! Now is the time. Today we rid East Anglia of Ruud's clan once and for all.
Hey! <laughs> You remember the dream I spoke of? You sail through Helheim on a ship of fire. Here, it may come to pass. Dreams. Life. Maybe they are one and the same. Tonight I ride the flaming sea steed, rushing for the spear den. A watcher alight on water's wake, another glory I will keep. Ready yourselves. Ruined shit stains will see us coming. to open these gates!
people of East Anglia have spoken for it. Give Spoken for it. Give yourself over. Saxon lover comes to fight. A miserable clan you lead, Ruid. Yes. The one that has bled this country dry for two summers. Flee, Ruid, while pity restrains my blade. It's up till I've taken all these shores after offer. East Anglia will have its king, and it will not be you. Troveling worm in a cage? You must be blind to stand with such a man. They should be ruled, Wolfkist. Made thralls, not treated as equals. We are better than this, than all of them. Do not drag me down to the sewers you wallow in. <coughs> For all your efforts, Come only the cold dark of Niflheim awaits you. <coughs> Valhalla is my destiny. That fate will not be met today. Why does a day... Thank you. Throw in with these wastrels, these Argir swine? For what? A scrap of land and a promise of peace? Evil! No! He should be tried before God, a lawful assembly. <laughs> <laughs> I won't have my reign begin with more blood spilt than is needed. Another screeching skull. This man must die for the damage he has wrought. The old laws are clear. These are Oswald's lands. To rule as king as he sees fit. Does Eivor bow to kings? To defy a king would shame him. East Anglia cannot heal without his honor intact. And what of your honor, Eivor? How much are you willing to lose? The rightful king of East Anglia has spared your life today, and so it will be. Compassion is a virtue suited for anyone, Eivor, including you. Thank you. Speak with Oswald. See if he's well. Praise the old father. Oswald lives. You fight well, heathen. Not bad yourself, Saxon. 
Thank you for heeding me, Eivor. I know the worth of such a gesture. All this is... is like a dream. But you are not asleep. Well fought! Well fought! The both of you! You came as well, old friend. If I'd known you were still alive, I would have stayed in Norwich. Look around you. A happy occasion and a glorious victory. And soon, something more grand to take place. Our wedding, my love. If you will still have me, that is. And why would I not? I fought poorly. I melted under the heat and anger of that brute. And I never... Oswald, stop. You fought with all your heart and soul. That's all you need ever do. Come then. We have much to prepare for. A bride to wed and a kingdom to lead. What some men wouldn't give for such things. Countless men have died for them. And you, Veneer? Are you jealous of such things? Hardly. My heart is afire, but my body aches. I desire only a long nap. I saw a bale of hay back there. Later, Abel. For now I must see to the wounded. Then I will see you at the wedding. Aye, of course you will. I should return to Elmenham. Oswald's wedding will soon begin. <laughs>